At the recent Lycanet Elite Seminar held at the Veltons Arena in Gelsenkirchen from the 7th to 8th of July 2023, Linus Lycanet My World Marketers in attendance found it difficult not to show frustration. The event raises many questions why no IPO took place. Most of the Elite's seminar's visitors attended the event because of the announced IPO. We could publish entire books with all the announcements, forecasts and promises of John Paul Shaw and Larissa Papel or My World itself. The CEO of BE Conflict Management, Mr Ben Ecker, attended the event live and finds clear words. This event's only purpose was to further stall the marketers while the big announced IPO was dealt with within three minutes. The marketer got his company shares, which they call stock, that's it. Congratulations, dear marketers. Now you have converted your money, which has gone into country packages, clouds, X, etc., into alleged company shares of the My World International AG. In the last few days, My World International AG has increased its shareholding to 100 million euros. But this does not mean that the equivalent value has also been deposited. Rather, space was created to dump the liabilities on marketers for the purpose of consolidation. This is how you turn short-term debts into long-term debts. Hence the registered shares with restricted transferability, which can only be traded with the consent of my world. In this way, Hubert Friedel can once again avoid paying off the clouds for another few years. The marketer believed in freely tradable shares and now has company shares that are neither tradable nor represent a stable value. The balance sheet of My World International AG has been published and speaks for itself. The KYC process, with its questions that can only be answered with yes, is pure fraud. The marketer is forced to tick yes, otherwise he will not get further in the process. This reminds me of the switch from Lioness to Lycanet nine or ten years ago, when the marketer was also forced to check the box. We have documented this new forced changeover and will submit it to the public prosecutors. The IPO in question was a farce. In exactly three minutes and 16 seconds, Hubert Friedel declares to his marketers, you are now shareholders, and plays a video in which a certificate seems to be the measure of all things. This certificate is nothing more than a receipt for how the marketer has devalued his already deposited money in 500 euro increments into company shares. This so-called share is nothing more than a company share at 500 euro of the money already deposited, which is shown on the certificate that one share equals 500 euro by My World International AG. One week before the elite seminar, the number of the shares quickly increased to 100 million, but the share capital did not increase. Presumably, and according to logic, the money already deposited by the marketers is now being used for consolidation. Consolidation is understood as the conversion of short-term debts into long-term debts. And so Hubert Friedel has his coerced marketers firmly under his control with restricted shares because the company share may only be sold or disposed of with the consent of my world. The capital is tied up and even in the event of a total loss, the shareholder has no claim to a refund because that is what a marketer must agree to in the KYC process. Not even 48 hours have passed since Hubert Friedel issued the company shares of My World International AG with certificates and the share price is already fixed at 590 euro. How was this value suddenly generated? The share will never be traded on a free market and was never intended by Hubert Friedel in the first place. The fairy tale of the IPO was only put out there to restore the marketer's faith. The My World International AG 
can set the value arbitrarily. The owner cannot trade the share other than to perhaps exchange internally among other marketers with the consent of my world. Hope exists for all of the injured parties because this switch is more than questionable as the marketer was forced to switch unconscionably. The marketer was given no choice but to tick the wrong box against his better judgment. If you joined Linus, Lycanet or My World and paid a down payment for future shopping, your investment remains your money and you do not have to accept Hubert Friedel's share proposition. If you are promised customers and associated commissions from advertising campaigns of which promises have not been met, you do not have to accept Hubert Friedel's share proposition. If you have paid down payments into foreign matrix investment schemes, you do not have to accept Hubert Friedel's share proposition. And if you do not wish to participate in a pyramid or Ponzi scheme, you do not have to accept Hubert Friedel's share proposition. Marketers do not have to accept Hubert Friedel's My World International AG's share proposition and do have the right to demand the refund of investments. Marketers should make their own decisions and not be advised by zealot uplines still actively promoting the scheme to obtain further financial advantage. It is beyond time to leave Lioness Lycanet My World and consider all legal steps. Lycanet's slogan, Together We Are Strong, finds its true meaning with our European Economic Interest Grouping Class Action Lawsuit as your claim, together with the claims of other damaged parties, is represented collectively. Lioness Lycanet My World marketers that wish to reclaim investments should contact BE Conflict Management to be represented in the class action lawsuit being brought against Hubert Friedel and responsible Lioness Lycanet My World Group companies.